So apparently, starting tomorrow, March the 1st, 2012, uh, throughout the week uh, until March the 7th, Google plans to make some changes to their privacy policies and what they do with the information collected uh, through your use of Google, uh, any of their sites from the search engine to YouTube to whatever else. Um, their AdSense, wherever you see their ads. And people seem to be uh, quite afraid of this. Like, my theory is the only time you have to be afraid is if you're doing something wrong. Now, you may not necessarily be doing something wrong. You may just want to protect yourself from this privacy invasion. I just did air quotes that you couldn't see. But privacy invasion. Well, it's fairly simple, and here's how you can. Most web browsers, Google Chrome, Internet Explorer, and Firefox all provide this Do Not Track, or DNT. So what you do is you get a current version of Firefox. I have Firefox 10.0.2, and you go into the options. You click on Privacy. And you see right here where my mouse is, tell websites I do not want to be tracked. You put a check in there, you click OK, and then you're done. Now on Internet Explorer, it is pretty simple to do as well. You just click on Tools and make sure you have a newer version because I don't think older versions of Internet Explorer offer this. And you click on manage add-ons and you go to tracking protection and you can add a list uh, by simply clicking here where it says getting a tracking protection list online and it'll take you to iegallery.com forward slash en forward slash tracking protection lists and you can simply block out Google and other sites from tracking you. Uh, I prefer to use Easy List. If you may recognize Easy List because of their association with AdBlock Plus, which is a popular ad blocker, you click Add and you click Add to List, and ta da, you are done. Now, You just simply close that and open it again and there you go. Easy privacy tracking protection enabled. For added protection and to delete cookies and temporary internet files in your history, uh, you can also do this. Uh, download CCleaner by Pyroform and I'll put a link in the video description to the website. It's completely free. You only have to pay for it if you want an enhanced version or a better version. I just use the free version because it does uh, good enough for me. And as you can see here for Internet Explorer it deletes your temporary internet files, history, cookies, recently typed URLs, index DAT files, last download location, autocomplete form history, and save passwords. Now it also does the same thing for Firefox as you can see here. Cache, history, cookies, a download history, session, site preferences, save form information, save passwords, compact databases. And if you had Google Chrome, it would do that too for Google Chrome. This is just some added protection that you can use, and it's freeware, so why not? And there you go, you pretty much have your privacy protected. I hope this helps. Thanks for watching. Bye.